Today I am going to tell you about the rules of falsification and how to memorize. Just remember one sentence that is the center number as this, uh, these are the examination days. So center number. Where is your center? Center 1 suppose is uh, Navoda Vidyalaya. Center 2 is uh, Kendri, uh, Kendri Vidyalaya. So center number and timing. At which time you are reaching? At the appropriate time you have to reach. So center number and the time. It doesn't matter how your preparation is. But you have to go at the time. So, center number and time direct that is it will decide your sequence that you will come first, second, your sequence and multiple fusion that your sequence that if you stand first there will be lots of friend who wants to fuse with you and lots of friendship occur after that. So, Center number and time. A direct sequence and multiple fusion. First coming to center. That the primary center of ossification lies in the diaphysis. Where is the secondary center of ossification? It is in the Epiphysis, that is the inch of long bone. And the diaphysis is the shaft of bone. From here, the ossification is start at first. After that, at the ends. So, primary center of ossification lies in the diaphysis. Where is the secondary center of ossification? Lies in the epiphysis. This tells about the center. Where the center resides. Okay, now coming to second point that is the number. Primary center, always it comes in uh, one. There has got only single, single center of ossification, the primary ossification center. Okay, and the secondary center which lies in the epiphysis, they are in multiple num number. Okay. So, second rule, that's about the number, okay, number of primary and the center, the primary and the secondary centers of ossification. Now, coming to third rule, it tells about the timing, at what time it starts to ossify, that is the primary center, it starts before birth and the secondary center, it starts after birth, but there are exceptions. Lamine. Some people uh, usually used to um, uh, stammer. Haklata hai, stammer. So, he always uh, tells jameen as lamine. So, the mnemonic is jameen or Jamin and uh, the stam one who is stammer, they tell lamin. So, exception are lateral cuneiform, medial cuneiform, intermediate cuneiform, and navicular. Here, the primary center of ossification starts after birth. These are the exceptions at the first year in the Lateral cuneiform, in the second year in the medial cuneiform, in the third year in the intermediate cuneiform and in the navicular bone in the fourth year. Like, that, uh, like this, the secondary center we all know it occurs, it appears after birth. But there is exception that in the lower end of femur it appears before birth or at the time of birth. Okay. So, 9 month or 8 month of pregnancy, it appears. And this is the also used as a medical, medical legal, it has got medical legal importance. Now, coming to 
fourth rule that is the direct direct is the direction nutrient foramen the direction of nutrient foramen is opposite to the growing end if nutrient foramen is towards the upper side then the nutrient artery that shows that nutrient artery is going upper side and the opposite that is the lower end will be the growing end because the growing end there is uh, more and more uh, osteoblast deposition which will hamper the growth of artery uh, art, uh, the movement of artery okay that's why artery chooses chooses to grow to chooses to run in the opposite direction okay and the mnemonic is that to the elbow i go and from the knee i flee if someone uh, wave wave hand that means uh, they are calling us okay and if someone kick we flee like this to the elbow i go from the knee i flee that is the nutrient foramen in case of elbow joint they are the nutrient foramen is towards the elbow that is the growing in just opposite so in case of upper limb bones the growing end of humerus will be the upper end and the growing end of radius and ulna is the lower end that is opposite to the elbow joint okay and in case of lower limb that is from the knee i flee from the knee i flee that is away from the knee joint is the direction of the nutrient foramen and so growing it will be towards the knee joint so lower end of femur and the upper end of the tibia and fibula they are the growing end clear now the fifth rule of sequence uh, fifth rule of ossification is the sequence that the center of ossification for epiphysis center of ossification for epiphysis if appear first then it will fuse last with the diaphysis okay it is just uh, uh, the same as that uh, if we go go to the mess for taking meal if we come uh, if we go first uh, we get in the last the meal we get in the last it usually happens to us we are going at first but getting the meal last but uh, the few fortunate one few fortunate one students uh, they will get if we if they go fast and get uh, get the meal fast and f for fortunate and f for fibula that is the exception is fibula here the center of ossification of, for epiphysis it appear first and fuses first with the diaphysis lower end of fibula this is the exception okay now coming to sixth rule that is the multiple if there are more center of ossification in sap that is the primary center of ossification they are in multiple number they appear at the same time and if center of ossification in the epiphysis if they are multiple they appear at different time okay so it says about the if there is multiple center of ossification if in the if it is primary there are multiple primary center of ossification it appears at the same time if there are multiple secondary center of ossification they appear at the different time now seventh rule of ossification is the fusion that in case of long bone the growing end the time of fusion of fusion of the growing end with the diaphysis is at the 20 year in case of growing in but opposite to the growing in the time of fusion will be 
टू ईयर अर्लियर डेट इज एट द एटीन ईयर दिस इज इन द केस ऑफ लॉन्ग बोन एंड इन मेल इन वुमेन द ग्रोइंग इन विल फ्यूज विद द डायफिस एट एटीन ईयर एंड अपोजिट टू द ग्रोइंग इन इट विल टू ईयर अर्लियर सो इट विल बी सिक्सटीन ईयर एंड एपीफाइसिस ऑफ अदर बोन अदर दैन द लॉन्ग बोन the fusion occur at 20 to 25 year so these are the rules of ossification thank you